crazy. <laughs> Let's start off with this building shot over here. Oh, pop me. This is going to be a pretty dope one. Let's get a bit closer and get a wide angle shot of this building. I'm honestly really curious to see what the results are going to be because I've never shot a raw on an iPhone before. So I also have this dope statue over here, which also always looks really good. Let's zoom in a bit. Honestly, the quality looks really great, you guys. I'm really curious to see how it will hold up in the edit. There we go. Oh my God, just look at this airplane flying over at the top. This is going to be a dope one. Maybe I can snap some shots from people going on the stairs. Alright, so this building right here is the Opera House of Antwerp and it looks really dope, not gonna lie. Let's wait for the right person to pass by. There we go. I think these shots are going to be amazing, not gonna lie. Hmm, if the guy over there doesn't run away. This might be a pretty cool shot. Try to take some interior shots. Let's take a shot of this pretty cool Thai street food restaurant. And this Five Guys restaurant will also look pretty cool as well. I really like the colors. They're really going to pop nicely. Especially with the guy passing. Let's try to take a shot of the inside over here. This one right here, I think, <laughs> is going to be one of my favorites for sure. I really like blue lights and especially if the people are going to pass by here. It's going to look really, really dope. Yeah, this one is going to be awesome. For sure, no doubt. Zero doubts. Let's get a wide angle shot as well. Out of camera, I think the colors look already really dope. Let's get a shot of this Indra parking sign as well. Decrease the exposure a bit. Yeah, that's it. I think this is gonna be a pretty cool one. I really need to remember this location for someone to yeah stand over there and do a shoot. I think it's going to be really cool. This is going to work even better when I get a bit closer, I think. When we get a wide angle shot. Yeah, this is going to be a banger for sure. Especially like this with the leading lines. Mm, this is a very interesting place to pass by. Honestly, I haven't shot some street photos over here before. The red lights over here look really cool. Let's see if we can do something with them. Mm, not sure, maybe on the wide angle end of the lens. Now let's get a classic shot of the central station of Antwerp on the left first. Oof. These neon lights with this man sitting over there. This is going to look really dope. Ah, there we go. This is going to be a banger for sure. And especially on a wide angle. Let's get a bit closer so we can get the wide angle shot of this building i think this is close enough it's a bit busy but we gotta work with what we have right oh just look at the radisson hotel over there 
That looks really amazing. Like the orange lights in front of the building with the blue sky. Shit. I gotta get a photo of that. I think from here this will work. Let's try to zoom in. Yeah, this is going to be a nice one. Let's zoom out a bit again. And let's try the wide angle as well. This is going to be nice. Hmm. This is a pretty nice composition as well. Because of the leading lines of the lights. Who was it? Oh shit, it wasn't even raw. I think a wide angle shot would work pretty well over here. Yeah, absolutely. It absolutely does. Just look at this beauty over here. Oh my god. So the first shot we're going to take is a classic of these stairways going up right here. There we go, we gotta get to the wide angle for sure. Now we also obviously gotta take a look up shot. Oof. Oof, these lines. This one is hard, you guys. This one is really hard. And then we'll just get a shot. Of this really cool ceiling right here with the royal cafe in front of it let's see if we can get some close-up detail shots with the three times zoom lens i think it's a bit less sharp but it's still great honestly for a phone let's take a shot through these pillars over here Ooh, this one is going to be really nice as well no doubt because of the leading lines and and the pillars you know uh, just look how beautiful this place is i can never never get bored of this it's just so huge and the colors and everything it's just so amazing oof this one is nice honestly this wide angle camera is really great let's get a bit of a close-up shot now we gotta take this classic shot over here for sure this one's just legendary i mean <laughs> you don't have to even be good at photography to take this shot it's just a super easy wide angle shot which is going to look good for sure this one is pretty cool as well This is going to be a pretty cool image of the man sitting over there. <coughs> Let's get a wide angle shot, right? A bit of a closer one. There we go. This one is going to really work as well because of the leading lines. Just like this photo right here. Honestly, if you want to see some cool architecture, you really got to come to the central station of Antwerp. This one right here could also make for a great shot. Yeah, this one is going to be really dope as well. Oh, 
Oh, this one is a pretty cool shot as well. <laughs> Shooting with the phone is really totally different. It's not like the first time that I'm doing this to take like professional photos. And it's really getting me out of my comfort zone, not gonna lie.